Hello everyone, my name is Nalini Mfulwe and it is my absolute pleasure to welcome you to the latest edition of the African Diaspora News Channel where we unravel the stories that shape our world and our communities. Today we dive deep into the currents of information from the pulse of politics to the heartbeat of entertainment. We've got it all covered. A 17-year-old from Nigeria, Khalifa Aminu, has developed a groundbreaking invention that could dramatically actually improve the lives of people who are blind. Now, Khalifa's invention is, is a pair of glasses equipped with sensors that actually beep to alert the wearer to nearby obstacles. Now, it's a simple yet revolutionary idea, and we believe that it has the potential to actually make a significant impact. Now, Khalifa's invention is, is a prime example of how imagination and creativity can actually lead to powerful solutions. Now, these glasses designed with built-in sensors actually emit audible alerts when an obstacle is detected. Now, for individuals who are visually impaired, this could mean enhanced mobility, greater independence, and a significant reduction in the risk of accidents. Now, I think what makes this invention particularly remarkable is its simplicity. The technology is straightforward, yet I think it also addresses a fundamental challenge faced by many people with visual impairments. Now, by providing a reliable and intuitive way to navigate their surroundings, Khalifa's glasses have actually the potential to transform the daily experiences and open up new opportunities for those who actually rely on them. Let's, let's have a look. Khalifa has actually already made a remarkable contribution to technology and accessibility. His journey from a young inventor in Nigeria to a potential game changer in assertive technology is both inspiring and encouraging. Khalifa's ability to actually conceptualize and bring this idea to fruition at such a young age actually speaks volumes about his creativity and determination. But um, the unfortunate thing is that Khalifa is actually seeking funding to move from prototype stage to full-scale manufacturing. Now, this is where the support of the global community becomes crucial. Turning a promising idea into a widely available product requires resources, expertise, and a network of supporters who actually believe in the vision. Personally, I am genuinely excited about Khalifa's invention. I, I think it represents more than just technological innovation. It's a testament to the power of youthful creativity and the impact on investing in young minds. In a world where technological advancement often come with hefty price tags and complex functionalities, Khalifa's glasses offer a refreshing practical solution to a real world problem. My, my only fear is, I think, as, as a young black innovator from a developing country, the reality is that his ideas are not safeguarded. Despite the excitement and the promise that new ideas hold, there is an unsettling risk that them folks might just seize them without credit and regard for him. Now, this fear is not, it's not merely theoretical. It's a harsh reality faced by many innovators from marginalized communities. 
my my concern stems from a troubling pattern that I've seen where individuals from underrepresented backgrounds, particularly those from third world countries, often see their groundbreaking ideas appropriated or outright stolen. But enough about the negative thoughts. If you are inspired by Khalifa's story and the potential of his invention, Consider supporting his efforts, whether through direct funding, networking opportunities, or spreading the word. I think that every bit of support will and can make a difference. Khalifa's glasses, uh, they represent a great beacon of hope. They remind us of the incredible things that can happen when young minds are given the opportunity to actually shine. We look forward to seeing how this invention actually evolves and hope to witness its positive impact on the lives of those who actually need it the most. Now, with that being said, let's engage in the comment section. What are your thoughts in regards to this? Um, while you're at it, please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. That's it from me. Till we meet again, it is goodbye for now. Introducing the African Diaspora News Channel app, your gateway to stories that's overlooked by the corporate mainstream media. And we serve as the voice to the global black community. Here we got Dr. Candace Matthews. A lot of these documents, you know, looking at. We are committed to informing and educating through the power of media. This country is supposed to be about the land of the free for all. It has not been free for black people and we are tired. With our platform, we're helping to end injustice by exposing it. Join us in standing for excellence in journalism and serving our community. Download the African Diaspora News app today.